Hey, it's Lauren with this week's Husky Happenings. Hi Huskies, it's Poppy here, and today I have two wonderful people to tell us about March's Reading Month, Mrs. Allen and Miss Barbara. So, Miss Allen, can you tell us about March's Reading Month? Sure. Um, March is Reading Month. We're super excited. Kicked off today. What we do March is Reading Month for is just to encourage students to read. We want all kids to read. So we're hoping that with March is Reading Month, it'll help bring those reluctant readers into enjoying the love of reading. Mrs. Barber is going to explain some of the PTO stuff that's going on with our fundraising. So this year we're doing things a little bit different for the readathon. Uh, we have two tables full of gifts. I'm sure all of you have seen it by now. Red table, we have full of raffle baskets that you can earn by reading. The more you read, the more you earn. And then we have a white table, which is for fundraising. And the best part about both of these tables is with a little bit of effort, you can earn a chance to win anything that you see on that table. So if there's something that you think is really cool, the more you fundraise or the more you read, you get a chance to win one of those prizes. So it's pretty easy. Fundraising sometimes sounds a little bit hard but it's a lot easier than you think. You can go to the neighbors that you know, make sure you bring a parent if you're younger, uh, call grandma. You might have an aunt or a cousin or just a close friend. So just do your best and read lots and lots of books. It's just real quick, I wanna mention our donation goal is $20,000. And with that, we can get new playground equipment, new technology, and our end goal is to get new middle school lockers. Hi Huskies, this is Faith with your weekly reminders. On Thursday, if you wear crazy socks, you can dress down. On Thursday, girls, JV, and varsity take on Cheryl Stockwell Academy. JV's game is at 5 o'clock, with varsity's game at 6. The boys' basketball team will travel to Holy Family. Game time is 5 o'clock. On Friday, there's a parent-teacher meeting for students who are transitioning to middle school at 5 o'clock in the auditorium. Following this meeting is Friday Fun Night for 5th and 6th graders from 6 to 9. On Saturday, March 9th, is our Someone Special Dance. The dance will be held in the gym from 6 to 8 p.m. That's all for this week's Weekly Reminders. See you later, Huskies. Bye! The JV and Varsity girls basketball teams are winding down their seasons. On Tuesday, March 5th, both teams took on Our Savior at home. The varsity game was a very intense game. The Huskies secured the win 20-14. to The leading scorer was Grace with 8 points. Avery had 6 points. And Adriana, Lauren, and Allison each scored 2 points. The Huskies will take on Cheryl Stockwell Academy this evening. JV starts at 5, and Varsity will play at 6. Come out and support your Huskies. Here are some highlights from this season. That's all for this week. Bye, Huskies.